Hi there, my name is James Tripp and welcome to createinstantchange.com. Now if you're watching this video, it's a fair guess on my part that you have an interest in hypnosis and more specifically, you have an interest in utilizing the tools and techniques of hypnosis to help people create powerful and profound changes in their lives. And why wouldn't you? Because that is a really cool thing to be able to do for people. Now I'm going to talk a little bit more about this in this video, but before I do, I'd like to share with you a clip of what I call micro change work, a very small, a very rapid piece of change work, precision tailored for a particular circumstance. This is what it looks like. Take a look at the clip. As you just hold that up and just look at the bottom of that coin, know everything that you need to know in this moment about that thing that if you could just let go of it, it would make a difference for you. Now you don't need to know everything just as much as your inner mind allows you to know now, but as you look at that coin, I'd like for you to just allow a connection to take place. So as everything that you know about that thing that will be useful to let go, just flows through you and through your arm and all the way into that coin, becoming concentrated, solidifying in that coin. As you look at that coin, everything about that which would be useful to let go concentrates into that coin. And just as soon as that's fully connected, fully flown into that coin, and you can experience that connection, so as that coin becomes that thing that you want to let go of, go ahead and just try and let go of that now. What happens when you try and let go of that now? Just try and let go of that now. It feels very heavy but insistent on sticking. Very so heavy. It feels very heavy. The coin actually feels very heavy. Very <coughs> heavy, but insistent on sticking. Mm. Very heavy, but insistent on sticking. I'm just going to borrow your hand, borrow your arm. Just notice that connection continuing now. That's as your elbow softens, relaxes down. And you can just let that start to travel towards your face now. Only as quickly as your inner mind is ready to make some changes and adjustments that will enable you to release that coin so that hand can just start to move towards your face. And you can close your eyes if you wish. That's right. That's right. That's right. So that, see that hand can continue to travel in towards your face. Only as quickly as your inner mind is ready to make some changes. Ooh, and it's gone, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. Now notice that as soon as your hand touches your face, you'll feel fully alert, fully refreshed, 100%, bam, back into regular, everyday. So what you've just seen is me utilizing a method called idiodynamic metaphor. And this is part of an array of hypnotic tools, both overt and covert, that you can use to help people make profound changes very, very rapidly. And there's an advantage to this because it means you can use them almost any time or any place, any context, and with anyone, anyone who wishes to make a change in their lives. You can be there, you can help them out. You don't have to be a big hypnotherapist with formal offices and all of this kind of stuff. You can be a guy or a girl with high powered skills in your back pocket, ready to deploy at any moment. Now, underpinning this idea is the idea of what I call micro change work. The ability to be able to make small but high impact changes with people that you can then leverage out to maximum effect. When you know how to arrange the situation hypnotically, you can take small changes and generate big changes. This is the art of micro change work, being able to do change work anytime, any place, anywhere. And this is what I want to be sharing with you. Let me share with you a quick story to give you an essence, a flavor of micro change work. I was talking to a friend recently who was not in the best of moods. He was not feeling very happy. Um, something had happened in his professional life that he saw as a pattern, as something that had been happening again and again and again. And he put it down to one particular memory that just kept coming up and bothering him and undermining his confidence, as he put it. So I asked him in that moment, would you like to see a magic trick with that? And he said, well, you know, what do you mean a magic trick? I said, a magic trick. You know, would you like to just have a different kind of experience around that, just like that, because you know that's been a pattern for you. And he said, well, yeah, sure. So I did a very quick piece of work with him that probably took no more than 45 seconds to a minute. And then afterwards, we checked in to notice what the difference was. And he was 
initially quite astounded and quite blown away. But not as astounded and blown away as he was about three or four days later when he rang me up saying, I don't know what you did, but it's absolutely amazing. Uh, you know, I, I felt totally different and I've slept brilliantly for the last three nights because he hadn't been sleeping well. He hadn't mentioned this at the time. So this is a side effect. It's what's called generative change. For him, that 45 seconds to a minute's worth of change work have made a massive high impact difference. Now, I'm curious if you would like to learn to be able to do that. If you would like to be able to create change for people, create instant change for people, pretty much anywhere you go in any kind of context. If you would, I would like to invite you to check out the information below this video and do go ahead and sign up. You'll get access to four webinars in which me and Nathan Thomas from Keys to the Mind are unpacking this entire system for micro change work and creating instant change. Anytime, any place, anywhere, with anyone, any context, being able to go in there, implement your hypnotic skills and get change happening fast. Okay. That's it, that's all I really need to say right now. So go ahead, sign up for the seminars. Before I go, I'd like to leave you with another quick clip of some micro change work. Again, this is in the context of a seminar. It's not out there uh, on the street or in a pub or in a place of work or anything like that, but the principles are still the same. You're seeing a little bit of it here. You're not seeing the hypnotic framing that goes on around that, but again, that's something we'll be unpacking in the seminars. Um, check it out, notice the difference that it makes in the short time that it takes to do it. Here it is, this is called the idiodynamic lever. Is there a, an emotional feeling that you're familiar with in life that you would like to reduce? Um, you, don't okay, have, okay. You, you don't have to say what it is, you can, you can keep it on 100% to yourself. Um, and when you think about that now, how, how familiar is that feeling? Reasonably, yeah. Reasonably. I think about it every day, anyway. Okay, so you think about it every day, it's reasonably familiar. Mm -hmm. And when you think about it now, and it's reasonably familiar, how strong is that when you think about that now on a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being? Um, I, could, I could say, if I really think about it, 8. 8. Okay, 8. So if 10 were up here, and 0 where your hand is, whereabouts would an 8 be? Just notice that feeling, and... and and put your hand where that will be for the eight. Okay. Now is that right? Is that about an eight? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can be aware of that. You can notice your hand. And notice that feeling at an eight. And is that right? It's about an eight, yes? Mm -hmm. So how, how is that? Oh, no, I don't think no, 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 no. Okay, so just let that start to drift down. That's it. Just as quickly as it needs to. And no quicker, so slowly. And you can just close your eyes. And I says, okay, that's interesting. And just notice that. And what does that know? It's silly. It's silly. Mm. Mm. And what difference does knowing that make? Mm. More fun. Life's more fun. Life's more fun. Life's more fun. And notice that. And allow that to continue to a wonderful point of conclusion. That's right. And just notice what you notice now. And you can open your eyes just as soon as you are aware of the difference or of a difference. Mm. Mm. Thank you. Well done.